New on the four, the Rainbow City Police Department is taking another step to keep your children safe. Oh, well, it's one of the first agencies in Alabama to participate in the Missing Kids Readiness Program, all through a partnership with the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children. Your East Alabama reporter, Reggie Kyle, on your side and live now after speaking with the chief about how this program can make a difference. Reggie. Sarah was a program that was discovered by one of his detectives. Rainbow City Police Chief Camp Yamsey believes this program will help save a child's life. Now this readiness program was developed in recordings to responding to when you get a call about a missing child that's abducted or sexually exploited. Now to meet the requirements of this program, the Rainbow City Police Department worked with the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children on their missing child policy to ensure it met critical elements of the policy for agencies. Now, Rainbow City Police Chief Camp Yancey tells me this type of training will ensure officers are on the same page and understanding some of the issues that can affect missing children. So uh, in the program, they talked about um, autism and uh, special needs, and I did not realize that um, a, a high percentage of, of those kids that uh, that get reported missing, um, you know, unfortunately, uh, they are found, uh, they're, they're almost attracted towards bodies of water. Now with Lake Neely, Henry, the Coosa River, and other bodies of water that surround Rainbow City, Camp Yancey says this gives his officers a better understanding. Your reporter in Rainbow City, I'm Reggie Kyle, WBRC 6 News on your side.